can't believe this is where he decided to set up shop. It wasn't like him to slum it. I always thought the abandoned water tower was an odd choice. I mean, the mold risk alone. It's not the abode of a man who asked me to steal a Renoir, that's for sure. Why don't you two go that way and see if anyone's around? Come on, John. We'll go check the other side. <laughs> Meow. Waller. Glad you answered. We need to talk. Listen about the convoy. We couldn't get to you safely. The EMP blast knocked out my ability to communicate with my field agents. I'm sorry. It obviously wasn't supposed to go down like that. Well, innocent people died because of your no-show. You think I don't know that? Those maniacs butchered my agents. My friends! I can't take losses like this. I need to lean on you even more now, Bruce. You being inside. It's our best hope. Well, now they have Riddler's body. It was cryogenically frozen. By the agency. Bruce, this was a 60-year-old man who went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman. I have some very interested researchers who wanted to see what kept him ticking. Wait, wait. Uh, I cut the punchline wrong. Uh, let me start off. It's fine, John. Riddler's eyes. They're a key to a door that lies somewhere in Gotham. And Harley doesn't know the location. She asked me to find it. Stay put for now and maintain your cover at all costs. This is our chance to get ahead of this train. So I say, Doc, I'll have what she's having. <laughs> <laughs> we snooped around. There's a police car nearby, but no officer in sight. And it could really use a wash. Maybe it's just placed there to scare off looters, but either way, we should be careful. Okay, let's find a way in. Just have to get through these boards. Don't worry, I brought my key. Hey, I believe in you, John. You show that wall who's boss. Hey, Bruce, I have an idea. Why don't you jimmy it open? Who's there? Don't move! Wait a minute. I know you. You're Bruce Wayne. Uh, guilty is charged. Want to explain what you're doing out here? This isn't exactly the heights. You know I'm friends with Jim Gordon. If you want to check on me, just call him up. You think I'm gonna interrupt the boss and his family at dinner? I don't know. Are you? Uh, oh, oh, okay. Detective... Bullock. Detective Bullock, right. Uh, look, there's... actually a very good reason for all of this. Stay right there, jerkwad. I'm calling this in. I've been asked to report any suspicious activity around here, and you're acting suspicious. Oh, come on now, Detective. We can work this out, just the two of us. I disagree. Bruce freaking Wayne. Unbelievable. Wouldn't even be working tonight if I didn't need the extra dough. But maybe this will make me look good with the boss. Oh, sure, sure. O overtime, right? Well, maybe... maybe I can help with that? I'm not that kind of cop. No, 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 of course not, of course not. This... this benefits both of us. Here, here, it's everything I got on me. Just hang up the phone, and it's yours. 
Try not to die in there. I do not want this coming back on me. Come on, let's get moving. a little warmth. Huh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. Me too. There's hope for everyone. I don't think any of us are beyond reach. <laughs> I know we've just met, but somehow I knew you'd say that. You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but... It's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Oh, I call the downstairs bedroom! <laughs> Careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. I'm getting really tempted to touch something! <laughs> How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something. This is where he built his boxes. Because he was a killer? Because he was rude to me! We need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. No, she's nice once you get to know her. Right, let's agree to disagree. But I'll keep my peepers peeled for both of us. Riddler so much. I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me. Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know. Made me look like an idiot in front of Harley. Those other guys. But hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. <laughs> I've been meaning to ask you. 
The green hair. What? What is? What is that? I don't know. What's with your black hair? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm, I'm a little sensitive about my style. I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to, well, here it was. I guess it's natural. John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? Her ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> Handcart. Wonder what he was moving. Let me help you out there, Bruce. I don't want you to bend your cover bow. the second inevitably follows. You have to work hard and sleep hard in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. Work, sleep, death. A little grim. A little Boring is what it is. Tesla coils. This whole place is an electrical death cage. If these start sending out energy, we'll all fry. <laughs> 